How are you doing, everyone? This is Dario from Media Box CNT Blockchain. And today we got the amazing Amazon Fire Stick trick. Yes, Amazon what? Amazon Square, Amazon Black, Amazon One, Amazon Two, and on Amazon that you plug in your TV and will play something such a movie or a picture. So a while ago, not too long, about a week, I got a message from David. He says, I'm not sure if you ever read messages. Well, I do. Sometimes it gets a little complicated because there's too many messages to be able to reply. But he wonders if it would be possible to install a hard drive and the fire stick. So when I reply, hi there, I do read messages and give me a week. I buy the parts and I will show you it can be done. So give me, he actually gave me a great idea. I said, this will be good for everybody. So let's put it in. You may wonder, you know what? I want to be able to put a USB keyboard or maybe a regular keyboard and a mouse. I want to install a hard drive. This case is 750 gig because that's what I got around. But there is a trick. Limit two terabytes. So stick around. And then I said, you know, how I can connect those? Well, I need a hub. Can I connect? You know what? My wireless is not working right. I got right near my TV. I have the box where I can connect my wire internet. So we connect the wire internet. Now, looks complicated. Wires all looks real nice, simple, and easy. Maybe we can have this, stick it all together, put it in the back of the TV, and it's beautiful. What do you got here? So let me explain. So what we got first, when you power, so when you five volts, you can maybe use the one uh, from the original five stick. Remember, if you're going to be powering a lot of device, it's nice to have uh, two amps or more if you have some good power supply. Possible. Right now, I'm using something else, but possible you can run the regular power supply should be good, but not, not less than two amps. So we go straight to a special cable USB. All the information, by the way, everything you need will be right below this video. So we got this cable. They will connect the power and the same time will send the power and the data on the fire stick. We got the output. It goes to my video card. Then now I need a type of hub. They will be able to read my USB. They will be able to read my hard drive. But one more. Why not we keep it one with the 45 It can read my internet. We can Amazon detect all that. So we're going to go into settings. Uh, I want to see that it's working. I don't know if you're really connected. Maybe you just paying a trick to me. Well, we go there. Let's go unconnected. To see a navigating. Check this out. You notice? It's really working. Well, we see the screen is actually working. We go into the main screen and you see I can browse. All right. If I got no internet, none of this will happen. So it's working. So now, if you guys want to fix this, that's perfect. Now, hard drive. So for hard drive situations, make sure we have a limit. And the limit is 2 terabyte. Why is 2 terabyte? Because Amazon Fire can only read FAT32. And the limit on FAT32 is 2 terabytes. Now, the trick is, if you try to format two terabytes now in your uh, Windows 10, you're not going to be able to do that. So at the end of the video, I will show you, if you don't know how to do that, I will give you the program and how to format a two terabyte or any drive you want. Even I'm going to reformat this drive and I show you how to do this. And you download the application for Windows. And if you are a Mac or Linux, you're going to be able to do it because they got all type of different command to do that, but in Windows a little different. So on Windows, you need to special program. It's free. Download it, install it, and we're going to format two terabytes. So you have two terabytes. What is good now, you can move files, you can move movies, you can put anything you want. And let's look. Now, you can use to play your movies. You can, I guess, use Kodi. My next video, we're going to be installing Kodi, by the way. So we can use Kodi. Let's go back. We can use uh, ES file. We can, if you have Plex, um, I think at Plex, you need to be registered. That's why I'm not trying. I'm a registered user. That's what will work for me. But I believe you need to be a registered user to work. So we're not going to try Plex. If you got Plex, it will work. You can use anything you want. But for me, let's use this. It's simple. We click in. And we see there. Now. The drive. Let me go down. 59.
and we see the drive right there so now it will play movies let's play something in this case i'm going to use just the default player then you will choose what you like to use all the time but if you see it's playing out of the hard drive it's playing out of the hard drive right now plenty easy you want to look pictures you can put your picture directories oh let's use the browser and it will play your pictures once again you can use Kodi, you can use any other software the proof for now is working can you store games yes look here i have uh i download again and store it now remember addition for this is gigabyte so you can carry here you can put a thousand games but you're not going to be able to install it right so make sure uh, it will get full but all your movies and all your games you can run it from here you see here now the keyboard is working takes a little while to detect the keyboard to detect the mouse all right in the beginning it will take a little bit i think it has something to do when i disconnect the bluetooth or leave the bluetooth but if you see if i press escape key it goes right away now this one took a while i'm not sure it's the keyboard we can try another keyboard but it's working perfect you can use this now you can connect usb type in the same so it says perfect make sure you leave a comment let me know what you think about this uh trick so this is software we're going to be using mini tool from petition magic i will leave the link also as well it's a free program now be careful with this make sure you know the drive all right because as you see how many drives some are my system some are my windows some are my my movies my mp3 so let's look the drive so i know that plug in a 750 so let's look for the 750 and it's this one right over here i know you guys saw the video you only saw 200 and gigabytes i was using for something else so i format 200 and this is unrecognized partition is not done yet so to prove sometimes what i do i just unplug my usb drive so be careful with this oh, wait a minute and let's see what's drive a all right so i already proved it that was a drive very simple so you put the drive either 200 gigabytes or one terabyte up to two terabytes this is the, this is one of the tools you need for your windows 10. in my case i don't care so we're going to hit here and we're going to delete or partitions remember when you do this it will destroy everything so we click yes when it's done we're going to click the apply that's real nice so you're sure that was the drive you apply you say yes takes a minute it's done now we're going to format the drive we can format any version we want so we go right over here we click create and as you see we can create many different let's see you can create your Linux uh, swap. Oh, so we're going to do Pat32. You can call it whatever data, movies, my MP3s. We don't care about the letter. We click OK. We apply. Say yes. And it's done. Now, this drive, you can put all your MP3s, all your movies, your pictures will be ready for you or your fire a stick. So remember the limit is to to revive so make sure you leave a comment like and i'm sure this will solve your problem so make sure you share this to your friends thank you